remember doing that video about how I felt about the Do I Sound Gay documentary. And I have a feeling one of the reasons why I speak as clearly as I do and focus so much on the sound, besides just having an ear and being really obsessive about sound, <laughs> Um, I mean, I used to take, I think I've said this before in some other video, but I might as well say it again. Um, I was so obsessive about the pitch of something, um, that it would bother me if there was something that was a fifth or a sixth of a step off. So when I'd get a Walkman, I would compare a, uh, pre-recorded tape to a CD. And if it was just a fifth of a step off, I'd take the Walkman back and say, no, I, I want one that the pitch is right. <laughs> it was really bad. Um, until I eventually just figured out how to adjust the potentiometer. I'd just take off the back of the Walkman, adjust the potentiometer, and I'd make it the right pitch myself. But when I was really little, one of my best friends, so to speak, was a tape recorder and a bunch of tapes, and I'd make up these little skits. I don't have any more of them anymore. Um, they got... They all got thrown away uh, by my mother in December of last year when I had moved to California. She thought I wasn't going to be back to the area. She was trying to get rid of stuff, and she threw out all my old tapes, but... Um... I almost wish I wouldn't have thought about that, but it's kind of a, like the majority of my childhood and some of the things that were happy about my childhood were just kind of destroyed. Um, but I would mess with the tape recorders. I would change the speed. I would find ways to disconnect the erase head. I would do a whole bunch of stuff, and I learned all about how special effects in movies were made by just experimenting. Oh, that's how they did that. You know? And it was always humorous to, to think about how, you know, how they might have done these sound effects in movies. Um, oh, I bet they did this and this and this. And then when I learned about the cables, how the sounds of, of lasers are just achieved by a long cable and they tap the cable and record it on the other end and stuff like that. Um, and then all the slow motion kind of stuff and uh, doing stuff in reverse and all of that. Um, sometimes I'd mess with tapes and f flip, you know, have the tape flipped over so it's muffled sounding, but you're still playing the backside of the tape and you'd hear it backwards and stuff. But when I would, I, I would, you know, and out of constantly making these skits and knowing exactly what my voice sounds like from an early age, I was able to home in on the way that I pronounced words. And there was quite a period of time where nobody was really doing that sort of thing until now we've got, we've got these uh, you know, smartphones and people are constantly recording little videos of themselves and people are constantly hearing what they really sound like and I just kind of wonder how much that improves people's speaking abilities. Um, you know, if you actually get to hear what you sound like um, do you make improvements? Or do you just keep talking the way you talk and say, well, that's the way that I sound and don't make any improvements? Or what? I don't know. Um, it's just kind of a question I have for any of you watching. Um, when you're able to hear what you sound like on a regular basis, um, 
do you use that to improve the way that you speak? Um, now, unless someone messes with a sampling program, they're not going to necessarily know of ways to uh, mess with the sound to know how they make they used to make sound effects in movies and things like that and maybe that part of it helped me as well um but i don't know just what what does when you record yourself what what does it do for you when you hear yourself talk what do you think of it? How do you respond to it? And do you use that to make improvements? I'm just curious. This is something I've done since I was really little. So, um, you know, it might be different when you're an adult. Uh, you know, I don't know. You know, I don't know. I don't know. Do you know? Anyway. <laughs>